Hello, I want to marry us into a Dan Machi season 2 episode 1! Ah, wow! Oh my god, after 4 years since the end of season 1, we finally, finally have season 2 for today's episode. Oh my god. Oh, I just waited so long, 4 years, man. And yes, hope you guys enjoy my movie reaction, which I did like not long ago to celebrate 400 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. And yes, along the way, we also have this, you know, random spin-off series for Damanchi. And then we have this uh, very edgy OVA. Yeah, swimming suit OVA. So you can say at least we have something between the line of, of the 4 years. So we, were, we weren't like forgotten about Damanchi, of course. And then today, we have the brand new season 2. So yeah, Damanchi, I mean, literally, in in the top of the Miami list and it's basically the most popular anime for season this summer 2019 and yeah I mean it beats um, Dr. Stone Vinland Saga in terms of members so you can pretty much guess it's gonna be the popular show of the season. So let's just say Damaji what do I remember from it? Well I have to be honest with you I don't remember much I'm, I'm quite foggy with season one but I remember some of the key details like you know Bell is actually the grandson of the, the Zeus the the god of gods so yeah and then we have we you know we watch this series because we want to see a lovely girl Hestia and not just Hestia the famous brush scene from the opening really make the scene for Damachi and it's basically the most mean to and the most recognized well, scene from Damachi so that's why everyone loves Damachi because of the brush scene and Hestia the, the opai lolly so that's why I want to watch the show again because I, I miss my girl Hestia although I watched the movie already but I want to see more of Hestia man she's funny no she's just funny man and she's just so adorable and so cute and she yes yeah, she's so short so yeah another gonna be another adventure for her familiar Belle with Lily and Welm, Welf if I remember his name correctly so let's just see what's her new adventure host for them and yes the movie didn't actually give a lot of hint of season 2 although I've been told that season during the movie there was uh, some scenes for some characters being introduced for season 2 but I, I don't really, really recognize them so yeah I'm looking forward to season 2 and see what sort of new adventure host for you know Belle and his team and of course we get to see Ice again be all dominant again and maybe Belle sooner or later gonna like match up to Ice so without further ado let's check out the first episode today and see what's in offer for us for this season so let's get started shall we Oh, you magician let's get started shall we oh my god oh my god season 2 Oh my god, I waited four years for this man. Let's do this in three, two, one, go. Oh yes. Oh familiar team and new member too. Well done, Bell. Get in there, Bell. <laughs> yeah. But isn't she from the another familiar? Okay. Ball. Mhm. <laughs> Actually, why is she part of the team? Did I miss something? <laughs> oh yeah she's still apologizing for that come on man just move on from that it's like four years ago yeah they're trying to go deeper into the dungeon what they've been doing maybe she joined the side because she feel guilty I think she is feeling guilty. Hmm. He wants to, he wants to, he wants to catch up to Eins. That much, hey! Yeah, you know, Belle wants to catch up to Eins, Ice, so that she can be by her side, like equal strength. Yeah, come by. Mm hmm. Level two. Wow, already. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Mm 
Come on, guys, get together, man. Don't think that when you level up, you're gonna you're gonna move on. Yeah, wh why are you talking about moving on to the next family or uh, something like that? Oh, so you need to get higher so they can level up. Since I need to get to level 3, I'll get to like somewhere higher up. And since I someone here to trouble them. Oh. Oh oh. Oh. Uh oh. Gonna ca Are you gonna cause a fire or something? Which part of Melia they're part of again? So just ignore them. They're just talking nonsense. My god, that guy's just jealous, man. Oh no, Bell gonna snap. He gonna snap. My god, that kid is running his mouth. Dude, shut him up for god's sake. Someone is wealth. Oh, like I said, we're gonna start a brawl. <sighs> yeah, show him who's boss. Oh. Oh. Oh, he looks troubling. Oh, oh shit. Oh. So, okay. A pro. Oh, level three. Uh. What happened? Oh. Oh, ho, ho. he's here to save the day. <laughs> yeah, there are no mess over, especially if I level three on this side. Man, Bell. Man, God, Bell. Always got himself in trouble. Hestia! I mean, could be health. They were just just bad mouthing, non-stop bad mouthing him like non-stop because of their ranks and stuff like that. And talking about Chachi about Hestia too, indirectly of course. Hmm. Hmm. Worry about his health more. That's good. Some good goddess right there. Mm, hold it in next time. Hmm. 
Apollo family are? Oh, is the, are they like the highest rank? <laughs> hmm. It seems like he got like a quite like a uh, uh, punishment only. Just a, a good quick chat chat. Oh, so, someone. Oh, they're being invited to their party. Oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least it's not gonna start fighting this place. So they invited to a party. Hmm. I have a bad feeling about this. So as so as the uh, my girl. <laughs> okay. Everyone. Does it include Loki's family or two? Wow, that's some fancy resident. Oh, oh well, well done, well dressed. Hestia! Oh. <laughs> Seems like all the goddesses here too. <laughs> hmm. Oh wow, look at this ballroom gathering. Oh, Hermes is here too. Yeah, the troublesome Hermes. <laughs> oh yeah, she was part of Hermes team. How should I forgot about that? Holy, the holy. <laughs> dere dere. Oh. <laughs> oh, Apollo's here. Hmm. Apollo, who, um, what God? What's up, God? Is he again? Oh, it's him, the level three guy. Eye contact on Bell, man. Yeah, how much of this is going to be fun, though? I have a feeling so he's going to start something. <laughs> Hestia, typical Hestia. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah. Interesting person. Let's see how much of that twist personality of his. <laughs> Dude, you have a spaghetti on your, your face right away. Huh? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Freya's here. <laughs> the one who schemed the the Manitou attack. <laughs> oh no, she cut eye contact with Bell. Dude, everyone fell for his charm, man. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, has <laughs> to the rescue. <laughs> Okay, she won't cause any trouble for now. Yeah. Loki. <sighs> Loki, man. <laughs> the god of mischief is here. <laughs> Look at the blush <laughs> and poker face. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh no, they're gonna start a, a ruck ass again. <laughs> it's always these two, man. <laughs> it's like Romeo and Juliet <laughs> situation right now. <laughs> By the way, Ice looks amazing in her dress, by the way. And she's looking at Belle's direction too. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh. Hmm. Oh, perfect timing. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> Typical situation, I guess. Oh, what are you going to talk about? Love? Oh, why his life story? Mm, yeah. yeah, what you heard from season one. Yeah, we get it, right, Belle? Hmm. Doesn't everyone want to be a hero? <laughs> Typical protagonist dream, I guess. I mean, he, we already know that if I want to become a hero from season one already, but yeah, I don't need to mention it again. <laughs> Oh. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Hermes. The <laughs> stance. Oh, he's going to lead the way, man. <laughs> <gasps> <laughs> Uh. 
still fighting. <laughs> yeah. He's the wingman, man. He's the wingman. <laughs> Oh, best wingman, man. <laughs> you are a dance. <laughs> <laughs> My lady. Take the lead, guy. Take the lead, Belle. Take the lead. Come on. You have to dance. Hi, you're a conde. Of course, man. Of course, you agree. She has interest in Daryl after all. <laughs> to be honest, I never been through. I never been to a ballroom dancing before. I'm not sure how hard is it. <laughs> No, oh, tango. Let's tango. <laughs> yeah, my man. <laughs> oh, yeah, never step under the girl's leg. I mean, beginners do, but avoid it as much as possible. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, Yeah, <laughs> they got the dance, man. Oh, oh. Okay, what's happening now? Oh. What now? Was he scheming? Oh my god, oh, that smile though. Are you kidding me? He's faking it. Really, man? Oh my god. This is a fucked up god. So he was skimmed this from the start. Okay, that Apollo person is the fucking ticket. Okay, why are they saying a mansion though? <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, I'm loving this opening, man. Oh, I'm loving this opening, man. <laughs> Why are they sitting in the mansion now? Maybe they want, they want the match and they just get to stay in some fancy house? Taiyose. Okay, for a start, Apollo is a fucking a-hole. The way he acts is straight up villainy, okay? You cannot tell me that he's not a villain with the way he acts. And just the way he moves his eyes. Dude, the way he, he do the facial expressions really, really showed his like true character and what so vil and how villainy he is. A, tr a real villain can tend to have like real like very disgusted face like that so you cannot tell me he's not gonna be the villain of the series because the way he acts is fucking a villain <sighs> okay yes next match next episode we get to see what kind of stupid match Apollo have having offered for Hestia Familia I mean he, I'm pretty sure in the, back in the pub they, was, they were actually scheming to get Belle to attack them so that he can fake the injury so that you know Apollo has some sort of excuse to challenge Hestia and his family to you know you know to a duel the winner takes Bell because they all remember everyone knows Bell's capability in terms of like you know adapting and stuff like that so I think it was made obvious from the last episode of season one so yeah I have a bad feeling about this match because like of course they have a level three on this side too so they're gonna use him and looks like that I mean the levels we get Bell quite a beating by the way. So yeah, I mean we have quite a nice ballroom scene. I mean it was cut short before because Apollo was like make uh confirmed Bell and talking about and fake and sort of the, uses fake uh, fake like subordinate injury to like challenge Bell to a duel. I mean he's a bad guy already from the way he acts, the way he, uh, the way he you know expresses expressions. By the way I, I love how they do the facial expression of Apollo, it just shows how, how much of a bad guy he is. So yeah, I mean, they all want to get Belle after all. So I think Hestia Familia got themselves a new member now, because she feel guilty. So they would, if she's bored, she, like, they're boring from Hermes' team. And it was quite a nice episode, I mean, the ballroom scene was quite nice, seeing Hestia and Loki fight together, like, oh my god, I can I just love the fact how we get to see Hestia and Loki fight again, uh, just so funny to see, as always, but doesn't change the fact that, um, we're going to, next episode, can, things going to get serious, and I think next episode, then, we get to see, like, a uh, proper development with Belle, maybe, like, get to see him, like, evolve more, because they're going to fight some level 3, or some of the awesome opponents, so, yeah. Can't wait to check out next episode. I mean, I'm really liking it so far. Get to see my girl has dear again. Oh, it's so long. Oh my god. So, yeah. Can't wait for next episode. And yeah, just can't wait to see how Belle show those people a piece of their mind and, and showing how OP he is it, being the grandson of those Zeus. So, Belle, you better not disappoint me next episode. So, hope you can enjoy my reaction today. And yes, by the way, the opening is the roping rock, the man. The opening is so good. And the animations, I mean, typical JC stuff animation after all. So yeah, hope you enjoyed my reaction today. Give a like, enjoy my reaction, subscribe, enjoy my reaction content, and I'll see you guys in the next reaction video, which will be Fire Force, Fruits Basket, and Araburu later in the day. So I'll see you guys then.